What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. So I am here with part two of that news bloopers compilation that I did over the weekend. Um, you can go and check that one out. But this is part two of that news bloopers compilation. So let's get into it. 2021 was proof once again that reporters should never work with children or animals around. <laughs> Ну, судя по всему, связь с нашим корреспондентом прервалась. Сейчас мы снова попытаемся с ней связаться. designed to unite a continent on one stage at a time of COVID-19 and when there are currently an average of 5,000 new infections recorded every day here in the Netherlands. She is like in play mode right now. She does not care that mommy's working at all. I want to know who she's talking to. <laughs> There's growing concern across this host nation about the wisdom or otherwise of putting on the world's biggest televised singing competition designed to unite a continent on one stage at a time of COVID-19 and where there are currently an average of approximately 5,000 new infections recorded every day here in the Netherlands. These latest two tests are evidence Eurovision is not immune. Anna Holligan, BBC News, in the Hague. <laughs> news anchors went completely off script. The premiere of the new drama, Debris. You can catch Nick Jonas as the host of Musical Guest this weekend on Saturday Night Live. Nick what's, Jonas? What's Debris? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that's terrible. Hollywood's award season, I'm sure it's great, gets underway. It's Sunday night. You can watch the Golden Globe Awards here on KC24, honoring the year's best in TV and movies. Oh, debris, I want to watch that. Sounds amazing. Well, state health officials want you to watch out for foam, apparently. Yeah, they issued their yearly warning on Thursday, asking people to avoid contact with foam on lakes and rivers. Uh, they say that it might have unknown chemicals or bacteria in it. Dangerous foam tends to be bright white, and it might pile up like shaving cream on the shoreline. If you do make contact with the foam, rinse it off or wash it immediately. Moral of the story here, just stick to the rivers and the lakes that you're used to. <laughs> that was so corny. Cool. That was good. That was good. Bravo. <laughs> Meteorologists were caught off guard. Who rocks is not a pop-up, but meteorologist Mike Rizzo, the daddy of weather. How's it looking outside? Weather daddy. Weather daddy, daddy. Mike. already now, Mike. Hashtag, right. hashtag weather, weather daddy. daddy. Mike. Hashtag weather daddy. Mike. 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 Poppy is here, and I'm going to deliver the forecast. Let's do this. It's like it's going to be a dip and dodge kind of weekend, maybe. Dip and dodge? Dip and dodge. Like dip and dodge. I'm going to dip and dodge. Like through a the cat. Store. Yeah, like, like a cat. Like an Elgato. Yeah. Okay. A what? Elgato, a cat. Oh, I've never heard it called that. Is uh, that? I don't Spanish. know. Spanish. Oh. <laughs> I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm worldly, I promise. Anyway, oh, and they just tossed you. No se llama Espanol. <laughs> I apologize, I'm sorry. I didn't say it. Segways transitioned into awkward impersonations. Hello, everybody, and happy Thanksgiving. I'm Rick Holmes. How's about you? How's about you, Annalisa? Where are we? What are we doing? Go, 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 go. That's scary. Hey, not one. Let's take four live looks outside. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> <laughs> pew. 
so Jen, I was trying to make, make the sirens now. <laughs> what? <laughs> and actually, I was trying to do AJ sound effect, and it just did not have the same impact. That sounded like pew pew pew. You were trying to go wee wee wee. <laughs> Overwhelmed by uncontrollable cases of the giggles. The conversations that happen in here. We are trying to get Mike signed up for his COVID vaccine and boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, let me three, two, one, focus. <laughs> now she's got me cold. Take a look at this point. <laughs> What's my policy number? <laughs> You're on the wrong website, Mike. Walgreens, follow me, dot com. Walgreens dot com. Good place to start. Cracking up at the worst times. That face, before my mother passed. <laughs> John. John, I'm sorry. Your timing is You did not do your homework. Your timing is horrific. <laughs> <laughs> yes, John, tell That's us about your mother passing. <laughs> okay. Oh, do not, you cannot do the laugh fit when we're not all together in no. the same room. Let, I know that. Okay. All right. John. Before my mom passed. <laughs> That's such bad timing. That's a terrible segue. <laughs> This is awful. It's very sad. Oh it is very sad. Okay. I'm so sorry. I'm lit. We're not little... Oh, God. Impossible news stories had them bursting into fits of laughter. <laughs> <laughs> a Texas lawyer showed up. Oh, a Texas lawyer showed up as a cat, as a cat on a Zoom court hearing <laughs> and claims a child turned the cat filter on and he couldn't turn it off. Don't know how to remove it. I've got my assistant here. She's trying to. Uh, I'm prepared to go forward with it. That's, I'm here live. That's not, it's hysterical because the other two are so serious. He's <laughs> here talking, talking through a cat The judge filter. was able to walk him through. <laughs> Botox on a camel, though. I 
it's it's up there. I mean, sixty six million dollars. It's a big deal. And I feel right? sorry for the camera. I do too. It's almost like I, seriously. It's almost like don't want a horse. It, 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 it is. It is. Yeah. It's, it's, really it's, bad. What you know. is the standard for beauty for a camera? I don't know. <laughs> difficult things for me is I have to sit here knowing that those camels are better looking than us. <laughs> there is no question. And for $66 million, you can throw a hump on me right now. Right. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. I have nothing against Botox. I'm official on that. <laughs> Not for animals, though. Yeah. That would take a lot of Botox to be right. I know. left in that camel. I know. Well, I'm thinking about other parts of, uh, of, of the body where you're throwing stuff. Okay, we should stop. <laughs> we should stop. We should stop. Jen is afraid of an FCC. Well, I, I am. Just... Be not afraid, Jen. Be not afraid. <laughs> you were a connoisseur of alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> Which we might be. I promise there's nothing in these drugs this morning. Uh, with a sense of mama lust. Here's a reason to pack your bags. Before you go to bed, there are three things to know. Number one, that last step on the porch is a doozy. <laughs> She's laughing about it. It's all good. <laughs> Ring doorbell again. footage. Can we see it again? She broke the window. She was not hurt, thankfully. <laughs> Number two. <laughs> Number two, uh, some people just are not, they're just not meant That's to drive. Let's stay with one. I think, I think we should ride. There's a, guy in, oh, listen, there's a guy in Poland who just failed his driver's test for the 192nd time. I'll give it to he's him. Been, he's been trying to get a license for 17 years. How old is he? He's in his 50s. Poor guy. What? When did he start taking it? When he was 10? What's we don't have his picture age? because, What's listen, you'd want to be anonymous, age too. Warsaw? What is the driving age in Warsaw? Uh, anyway, number three. I love his determination, though. <laughs> it's, uh, it's inspiring. Uh, number three, beware. <laughs> We're just wrecked right now. Please go back to one. Please go back to one. Number three, beware flaming out-of-control vans in Arkansas. Oh, my gosh. Is that being driven by the man of Poland? <laughs> this... <laughs> I'm in tears here. Listen, apparently the, the truck overheated. There was nobody in it, thankfully. <laughs> All right, Christine, i got to ask you, just play one again. Just, just one more time. Number one. I think we all need to see it. <laughs> Poor woman. Listen, uh, she's laughing. I guess we can laugh, right? Oh, it's horrible. <laughs> Take the Listen, I've fallen plenty of times. <laughs> My head never ended up in a garbage can, though. <laughs> Please get that camera off of me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is <laughs> too funny. <laughs> Seriously, keep this going all night long, Ray. There is nothing I can do to, to top this. There is nothing I can say to top this. Your weather for the weekend is great. Let's loop number one all night long. <laughs> that is fantastic. Oh my gosh, y'all. I get a kick out of watching these news bloopers. Some of these I've seen, and some of them, it you know, I don't mind seeing again because they're so funny. Oh my gosh, man. I can't stress it enough. I give these newscasters tons and tons of credit because they go through a lot, and they have their moments, and it's fun to see them have fun at work at their expense. <laughs> Leave your comments down below. Let me know if you enjoyed this compilation. And if you enjoyed my reaction to it, let me know as well. And if you haven't done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit like, share, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you guys can get notified whenever I pop up on your feed. I'll see you guys later.